Kim Kardashian had a brush with her past when she went to the Laker game last mm. night. She was sitting courtside, Natch. Now, it wasn't involving Will Farrell. I guess you could say it's Will Farrell adjacent, quite literally here. But the guy who's sitting between Will and Kim is a very close friend of Chris Humphreys. And you may be going, why do I know that name, Chris Humphreys? Oh, that's right, Kim's ex-husband. The guy she was married to for, what, 72 days? Yep. But that guy Wait. who's sitting next to her is oh. Peter Cornell. He was a groomsman. There he is. Yeah. You think that this conversation would be slightly awkward. Obviously, he was one of Chris Humphrey's best friends, best enough for exactly what you guys said. He was a part of the wedding. But they looked very chatty, looked kind of flirty. It was a very animated conversation. Um, but you got to wonder, like, what is happening here? Of course, he is, like, so good looking. I feel like anybody would want to chat him up anyways. And he actually was a basketball player. That's how he knows Chris Humphreys. Now he's a real estate agent. And if you guys also recognize the name it's because in selling sunset christine and emma they like were fighting over this guy and there was like a whole bunch oh, really? of drama about like if christine was engaged Whoa. to him and anyways he was a part of that as well so yeah i'll say this and, and that i hadn't even considered the dating stuff but i think it obviously shows that chris and kim are okay i i don't you well, don't not think necessarily so? what would your would your would one of your good buddies yeah, they might have had a conversation. Smile and have I, I'm sure they had a conversation I, where it was like, oh, what, how's Chris been? I mean, What's I know you remember this, Charles. This was this was hell on Chris Humphreys. I remember yes. how he was treated as he even yeah, when he played really uh, his NBA games. But maybe? No. You don't think so? I mean, it wouldn't be right. that. Like, talk about violating bro code. <laughs>